The best bocce players I've ever met get together at the north end of Branchbrook Park in Newark. They take no prisoners. They don't miss a day, ever. Are you guys going to have a fist fight? Okay. It's red. It's red. It's green. It's green. But don't you play for one of the teams? In our shape. In a cross team. <laughs> from here to New York. You all know Phil Elijah. He's a friend of the show. Uh, when he's not his work as chief of staff to Essex County Executive Joe DiVincenza, uh, he's playing a little botch. I had never actually played myself, so when I got set up to face Phil and his boys, we'll call it educational. I got all I wanted pretty darn quick. <laughs> Holy mac. Uh -huh. This is fantastic. You don't get this kind of drama on a Wednesday. Two rounds, six nothing. You got to get to 16. Five dollars. Is there, is there an ATM here at Branchbrook Park? No. The boys are good, no question. They brought a little hardware home that they won at the Anthony Fasano tournament. Uh, they said they had to show Morris County uh, a little thing or two. We sent them back 11 to 1. So we had to send them back to Morris County to show them who the champions were. No? Uh, oh. no. Phil adds that his late father brought him out to the courts for the first time when Phil was just a kid. His dad played there all the time. Uh, but Phil plays because he enjoys it, uh, but he adds that it's a good way to stay close to his father's memory. I come here to pay respect for my father because this is where he hung out, but the Italian guys, the, you know, I, I feel his spirit more here than going to the cemetery. So, so for me, it's a special area. A lot of the guys are retired and they say there's a hundred other things they could be doing. Uh, but as much as they like the sport and they do love it, uh, it's the bonds built through playing the game together that stand out. Holy mackerel. What does that thing weigh? Three pounds? You can break a toe. I met my friends here. They come here every day. Uh, there's something to do over here in the park. You know, and, and we play bocce every day almost. Hey, what a shot. <laughs> what a shot. I still think no it's No idea right what happens now. If a fool and his money are soon parted, uh, I'm glad to say I didn't lose a dime to these guys, but it's because I didn't bet. If I had, I'd have gotten cleaned out. Um, these guys work their will on the bocce court. There wasn't much trying going on. They no. want to make a shot, they make it. But especially with the hard bocce shot, the one that cleans out all the other balls. I was impressed. They're here 365 days a year. You Even come- when it's 20 degrees out? When it's 20 degrees out, they come, they have to, they're not as good because they play with gloves. Sure. I, I have to take the winters off because I don't know how they do it. Yeah.